The flight controllers, along with the pilot, have all been briefed earlier by the flight director on the mission plan and objectives. Okay, gentlemen, if I can have your attention. This is a lunar simulation flight from Mr. Reen. The altitude is 300 feet. And Phil, for your information, the wind's 20, 25 feet per second, basically out of the east, northeast. Dave, the uh, vehicle is sitting on this runway right now, and it looks like we probably ought to have the entire field closed, so when we get ready for takeoff, we may switch over to runway 17. Uh, the winds, I said, are on the east and northeast. The pilot's been briefed to take off and hover under the wind about 50 feet. Probably will need a balance check at, uh, at that time. We'll move the vehicle down towards the 100-foot marker, and the screen will begin to climb to about 300 feet. Okay, you'll check the winds at that point. We'll give them sim clearance. We'll turn around downwind, turn the lunar sim switch on, we'll move comp on, and begin to sim down the runway this way to terminate the action down this area. Any questions on the mission at all? Any questions about the wind? Okay, that's good. The engines of service, the jet engine with conventional JP4 jet fuel, the rocket engines with peroxide fuel. The peroxide fuel is toxic, and the technicians must wear protective garments. The flight director, in the meantime, stays in communication with the Ellington Air Force Base control tower to coordinate LLTV flights with other traffic. Flight director stays in touch with NASA weather personnel to check on weather conditions. Okay, 951, uh, we've got the latest wind plot showing maximum winds 25 feet per second up to 400 feet. He makes certain that flight support personnel are on station. White Bird flight radio check. Flight, this is White Bird, read you loud and clear. Pedro flight radio check. Read you loud and clear. Crew chief. Loud and clear. 951, you can proceed with the checklist. Roger. Cockpit is secure. Loose articles have been removed. I have the oxygen system checked, and the two pins are out. Emergency throttle is in the normal position. Half circuit breaker 28 up. Correction, half circuit breaker 20 up. 28 is down, and I'm setting the T-handle friction at this time. Roger. T-handle friction has been set. All breakers are in except 28. Instrument lights will be off for this flight. I have the Doppler on and the altimeter is on. Setting the peroxide computer at this time, I'll set it for 784. Thank you. Battery is on, DC is off, and I have the AC on. ACS is going safe. Throttle is verified off, and we're ready. Thank you. Light off. Okay. Okay, the DC is going on. External power and air have been disconnected. The EGT is 532 and rising slowly. Oil pressure light just came on. The RPM is uh, 46. The oil pressure uh, is about 14. The DC voltage is 28. Could you set the valve? The engine start. I'm standing by for attitude control check. Roger. Okay, and the area is clear. Area clear. I do clear the ACS to flight. Yeah, good control check. And what comp is on. Three to eight. ACS checks on. The two control you. checks have been completed before takeoff. The gimbal lock is on. Cleared for takeoff. Cleared for takeoff. Negative one on the H dot. Cleared for takeoff. Okay, hands off for your balance. 15 feet per second. Okay. He has a beta. I'm hovering at 99 percent. Welcome, Vertical. 
local vertical. Altitudes approaching 100. Left side, maybe about 30 seconds. There's about a 9 degree cost. Climbing. Balance is good. Thank you. And the wind is reading 25. Clear for landing simulation. Okay. This altitude is 300. There's a piece of Two minutes to DP4, 50%. Thank you. Approaching 40% go. Okay. Crosswind. Okay. Runner SIM switch is on. Camera's on. Okay. Approaching. Speed should drop off now then. Sorry. Okay, now I'm showing a crosswind here. Of uh, some magnitude. It should be coming forward now. Okay. Showing 32%. Okay, everything looks good. Auto drive looks good. Okay, gimbal lock is off. Here's speed is yellow way off. Okay, on back again. Here's speed drops below 30. Descent rate's 10. Altitude's 200. Parking board. Okay, here's speed dropping back 50. Altitude's approaching 100. One minute to fifty percent. Thank you. This is right four. Altitude one hundred is in right four airspeed so five. the mission will be reviewed by the pilot, the flight director, and flight controllers. Problems will be discussed, comments will be recorded for later study. Not until the pilot has flown at least 22 missions in the LLTV, plus those required to maintain flight readiness and to perfect specialized landing techniques, will he be ready to undertake a lunar landing. Only then is he ready to deal with the strange handling characteristics of the greatly differing lunar module in an unfamiliar situation, the last 300 feet to the surface of the moon. 